My first encounter with an art thief was in middle school. Like a lot of people out there, I liked to doodle during class. Up till college, I always had what I call my doodle paper that would be right next to my lecture notes. It kept me from being bored and falling asleep in class when the lecture gets slow. One day, in my sixth grade class, I was walking back to my seat after using the pencil sharpener. Remember those? And I noticed a very familiar looking piece of art in someone's binder. Hey, that kind of looks like my art, I said to the owner of the binder. Let's call him M. Yep. Yep, it's mine. Yep. Uh, what? I recycled this like two weeks ago. Yep. During that time in my non-assistant art career, I would recycle all my drawings after each class because I didn't think they were good enough to keep. This dude admitted that he would wait for me to recycle my drawings so that he can yoink it out of the recycling bin. What? Em, why didn't you just ask me like a normal person and not be a creepy lurker every time I got near the recycling bin? Why? Em had a whole binder devoted to my scrap doodles, at least 30 binder pages worth. To be honest, I was shocked at first, but looking back, I guess it's a little flattering that he would devote a whole binder to my pencil scribbles. And that was my first encounter with an art thief. Question for you guys, is it considered theft or art theft if you threw away your art and someone takes it out of the trash? I mean, I did intend for it to be recycled, I guess. I know dumpster diving is legal in some areas. Comment below your thoughts. Thanks for watching.